According to the American Psychological Association, discrimination is defined as the unfair or prejudicial treatment of people or groups based on characteristics. Some of these characteristics include age, sexual orientation, gender, race, and disability. Even though laws and bills are being passed yearly in America to combat this national issue, it seems like discrimination will never end. A perfect example would be the many racially motivated killings that have occurred in the last couple of months. Whether the victims are Asian, Latino, or Black, it is unjustifiable for there being as many killings as there are. As an Asian woman, I deeply resonate with the victims of the Atlanta shooting, and I have thought about different ways that this shooting could have been prevented. On March 16, 2021, 21-year-old Robert Aaron Long brutally murdered eight people, six of which were of Asian descent. He shot all of these victims. This horrific crime occurred in Atlanta, Georgia. Although his motive was due to sexual temptation, many experts have argued that race cannot be ruled out as a factor either. This is because of the constant fetishization of Asian women. In addition to this, there has been a rise in Asian hate crimes due to the COVID-19 virus being called the China virus by many people, including former President Donald Trump. The shooter, Long, was able to easily purchase a gun days before the shooting. In Georgia, anybody could walk into a licensed gun seller and they could purchase the same day after passing a background check. One of the ways that the shootings could have been prevented is if there was a deeper background check against gun purchasers. Mental health screenings should be mandatory for all present and future gun holders. Also, there should be interviews done with people close to the future gun holder. If the gun store employees spoke to Long's parents, they would have found out that Long's sexual addiction was a huge concern of theirs to the point that Long was kicked out of his parents' house the day before the shooting. This startling fact was found out in law enforcement interviews. In addition, a waiting period to obtain a gun could have prevented the shooting. According to the CDC, a waiting period forces a cooling off time frame for anyone that wishes to commit impulsive crimes. It gives the government more time to do a background check, and it also allows someone contemplating suicide to reconsider their choice. If Long truly wished to target Asians in his shooting, these simple regulations could have prevented the horrific attacks before they started. Sadly, none of these basic preventions were taken before the fatal shootings. Luckily, progress has been made in addressing and combating Asian American hatred. According to CNN, a bill was passed by the Senate on April 22, 2021. This bill, titled the COVID-19 Hate Crimes Act, would ensure there would be raised awareness of hate crimes during the pandemic. Even though this bill is being passed about 14 months since the pandemic started, it is still better late than never. Hopefully, more laws, bills, and regulations can help decrease the amount of agent discrimination.